Hey guys, welcome to Gav Gaming TV. Today we are starting a new Let's Play Gold Rush the game. Now, uh, this is running on uh, high graphics, I think, at the minute. So it's not going to be brilliant, but that's only so that I can record. Because um, it doesn't quite like being an ultra and recording at the same time, or even running at the minute. It's not very brilliantly optimized. So. Any lag that you see on the screen is probably what I'm seeing as well down here. You see the textures will come in slowly. Uh, disable diff lock. Now this will probably get used quite regular because I can't remember the controls. Because I'll be driving and stuff with my Xbox controller. But obviously I will be uh, working on stuff with the uh, mouse and keyboard like usual. So... Um, Get onto a decent view outside. There we go. And uh, what was it to turn the engine on these days? I can't remember now. Oh, an arm brake was here. Right. So let's cruise on down to where we're supposed to be going, which I think is the bank, which is just down there off the main street. the engine on this oh there we go I like how it keeps you like third person for the vehicles and that and first for getting out that's pretty cool so apparently I can't get over a path so old Arnold parcel is apparently the place we've got to go first uh, price per square feet is I'm assuming two bucks this is for us, we're buying it. Um, provision of rent is $0.2, is it? So 20 cents maybe. Uh, area is 10,000. Don't know what that's in. Square thousand feet, I don't know. Uh, expected amount of gold, 15. Is it ounces? Kilos? Tons? I don't know. Uh, dirtiness of the parcel, 10. So I don't know what that means either. Uh, it's got a large creek for a water source and it's the state of Alaska who own it. So, apparently we have to rent this gaff. Bosh, done. And you can get loans, stocks, gold bars that you get in the cell. So obviously I think you get more money for selling gold bars because it's a bit purer. It has been um, thinging already. Smelted down all the craps out of it. Apparently I've always got to turn the diff off, yeah, yeah, yeah. You should disable the diff lock, well, that's what it's not even on, to be fair. Right, where is it anyways? We'll put it on, and we'll turn it off and see if that does anything. I'm assuming I'm going to have to get equipment. Well, with a couple of hundred bucks, I wouldn't have thought that would have been possible, would it? Where's a map? Have we got a map? There we go then. So I've just rented. There it is down there. We've got a tent and a camper. So I pull right out of here, main road, and then right again. Basically back to where I've just been. And we'll go down and we'll have a nose and see what we've got here. Pretty nice graphics. I mean, I know it has to load in. Uh, no, it's not down there, is it? It's the next junction here. I know it has to load in a lot of stuff, so I'm hoping they get that sorted soon as well with the caching and things. So he's loading in the terrain now, like. Which, you know, on. Even my PC, which is fairly powerful, shouldn't really need to do that too much. I 
I think I'm going right away. There's a power station. I think I'm bang a left down here somewhere on. Oh, is it loading again? To be fair, it's not running too badly on the the recording side. It's running a hell of a lot better than it did. It was shocking when I played the demo on this and attempted to um, to do this like. So we're in here, I think. It's off to the left. I think. Let's just slam on and check. Yeah, so we go left down here and down that road. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay. So we're going down here. Is we'll manage to use a dev lock. Welcome to the auto. Oh, crashed them already now. All on on parcel. I really need to stop looking at the terrain and watch what I'm driving down. <laughs> so there is wildlife in the game, you will see the odd deer that running around. And I think. There's birds and stuff, so I think in the future you may be able to buy rifles and stuff. So we actually have a good set of digging area over here. Isn't this the, uh, no, I thought this was the one that you get in the demo thing, but it doesn't. Yeah, it is. this is the area you get in the demo, isn't it? Okay. I'll break on. Lock off the end, John. Let's go and see. We're always going to put the handbrake on because otherwise your car will roll away and that will not be good. So let's have a look what we've got in here. Not a lot. A fishing rod, can't go fishing though. <laughs> Got your backpack and stuff. It's a lovely day out. Fire looks good. We'll run up here in our old uh, caravan. Got to sleep. Oh, okay. So I'm assuming. Yeah, some pair that land over here, look. So we're going to have to go into town and get a few bits and bats. So if you give us a sec, you, you can rejoin us in the town and uh, we'll see uh, what we can get. Okay, so here we are at the shop and apparently if you uh, put gold in as your save game or have it in the sentence you get a lot of gold <laughs> um, I think I've heard something about money as well I put gold in hills I was going to put gold in them their hills but it won't fit um, so I just need to find out where I can cash that in at to be honest because I ain't sure where would you cash your gold in? Machine Park, Blacksmiths, Gas Station, I'm assuming a bank, is it really? Let's have a look at the map. How many have you got claims wise? You got one, two, three, four claims, and they're fairly large. I mean, that one down there looks massive. That one looks huge as well. And these ones have wee tents and campers there, so I'm assuming they're for like. Starting out in, sort of thing. Pretty cool. And you get your journal here, so your tier 1 stuff. So we need uh, the hog pan with no pump. Hog pan sluice core, two hog pan mats, and a bucket. 
Now you can get a hog pan. I mean that's your tier two stuff. The tier I think the tier two is what you had in the demo. Then your tier three is getting onto the big gear then. Whoa. The tier three is when you get a wave table up, which is weird. I suppose you can do it however you want, to be fair. So, let's see. Let's see what we can get. Do it, maybe... Maybe the bank. Can you get this into the... We'll quickly run down to the bank and see. That's where you flog your gold. Uh, I thought... Nope. So where do you sell your gold? Must be somewhere in the town. Unless the warehouse takes it, I don't know. We'll have a nose here, places, shops and services. Park shop machine. Blacksmiths. It's actually quite good that I have all the wee videos here, like. So smelting gold obviously costs money. Well, you can skip through the video. Blacksmith. Ask the question. There's a police station. Pub. Can't go in there and spend your uh, hard earned gold. Blacksmiths is. Well, beer, apparently. I think. Was it? Yep. Yeah. I don't do it the freaking hard way by running, but you know, gotta figure these things out. I mean, obviously, not gonna uh, get rid of all this gold and then buy the freaking best equipment going. I do want to start with the smaller stuff and see what I can make. Alright, let's see what we can do. That costs a lot to actually make your gold bars. Wow. I'll tell you what, we'll sell. A little bit of it. And we sold 100 ounce. That's giving us 99 grand. So I'm not going to use all that. I'm just going to buy the simple equipment first. And then we'll work our way up. Like. That is quite a lot. I didn't realise it did that. So. 
So, let's have a nose in what we can get. It's easier trailers and stuff. I might get one of these straight away, to be fair, because the trailer is always handy. 31 gun, 19 gun. I like the small one, but. Depends on what other equipment we're going to be getting. This is your sort of stuff over here. Now we're going to need. For what I want, I want. No pump. I want the one with the pump, obviously. We're going to need some mats. Corn and extension. They're actually pretty cheap, so we'll get them two bits. And then I'm going to need some pipes for the pump and all that sort of stuff, aren't I? Right. So, first off, let's go and get a trailer. Oh, what else will we need, actually? What have we got over here? Oh. Duct tape for later on. Jerry cans I'll need. Water table jets, oh, so you can figure out what's going to break by looking in here as well. All your different uh, seven meter hooks, four, five. Oh, that's quite cool as well. Right, so let's get the trailer first. Just the one, and then. We're going to need a couple of jerry cans for um, filling the thing up. We'll get three buckets. Never have too many buckets. Oh, look at all this cool stuff here. Twin power up extensions. Cool. We need water hoses, possibly two, can't remember. Definitely need one of them to suck the water up. That needs a filter, which is... I haven't actually seen it yet. Uh, where's the filters for that thing? What have we got? Oh, there they are. There they are. Need a water filter. So we got over here like teeth and cogs and jacks and all sorts. That's pretty cool. So there's actually a lot you can get from these places. Can you get the hammer? Can you buy the hammer? No. Okay. Fair enough. Can't buy the hammer. Uh, so what did I say I wanted? I wanted the one with the pump. I want one of them and we'll get the extension while we're here. Uh, can't add it more oh, maximum for my uh, thing I think. Alright, I'll go over here and buy this stuff. Yeah, you must only be uh, 43 out of 44 slots. So that's actually quite a lot. So we'll buy all that. And then we'll go outside and we'll start sorting it out, shall we? So you can see the trailer's already there, so... I'll tell you what. We'll start dumping stuff in it. Oh, I've got them already. <laughs> Golden Retriever. Alright, we'll dump that in there. We'll... Yeah, so I still need the extension. It's really hard walking with that thing because I can't see where I'm going. Oh, I'm stuck on something. I'm stuck on everything. Let's see if we can dump it in this way. Bosh, there we go. 
that is going to go on that now because I will lose it. Guaranteed fact. It will be lost. The pipes I will put in the back of the truck actually. So this is the first time I've actually fired this up guys. Um, I still need to set a few controls. But well, not many to be honest. Fuel cans in here too. Even though I'm going to need to fill them up in a bit. Whoops a daisy. Whoops a daisy. I'm not sure if I need two of them. I know I definitely need one. But if we don't well, we can use it on someone else, can't we? And then we have the three buckets. Why can't we put these buckets inside each other? Seriously? So that quantity must be how much you can actually fit in that space. You know, that's whoops. That's, that's there. We'll dump these in here as well for now. I like how you have to do everything manually. I think that's pretty cool. you got to go pick stuff up, you know, take it around, set it how you want. I actually really like that sort of thing. Right, so what else did I need? I need... Back again, mate, not bought everything yet. I need... A wee water pump. Let's take up five spaces. Mobile Jenny. I want the ex extension so I'm gonna need four or five mats I think oh jeez we're gonna get three at the minute right go and get this stuff out of the way might take up an awful lot of room don't they Chuck them in there for now. I don't know if there's a financial thing on this, is this? You can see how much money you've spent. No. Should be interesting to, to have a look at, to be honest. I'm really out to see where I'm going with carrying this thing. Wheel. Uh, on here. Dump that in there as well. Hopefully that's going to stay where I put it. Okay, this one might be going in the truck. <laughs> Pick that up and carry it over here. I'll dump that on top of there. It's a little far forward. It's better. So I wanted, what was that, three mats I think I got there? So I want another two, maybe. Um, got the buckets. There's a pan in the tent, isn't there? Was there a big, you know, the big cleaning out one? I think there was, because there's none round here, as far as I can see. It's got wheels and stuff, you must be able to blow wheels up. Pickup truck, wait, oh, so you must be able to pop wheels in your pickup truck. That would be terrible if you've got to walk all the way back here with that, wouldn't it? Oh no, there's a big bucket. Do we have that? Probably not. I'll we'll have to get that as well, just in case. First aid, torches. Right, I think that's everything. I think. So let's get these last wee bits. Oh, I've got itchy on. Oh. Get these last wee bits loaded up. See if this will work. I 
That's what I love about physics based games, you can pile everything in. And just about, it looks like he's stirring them up. Just about, nearly getting away with it. Or not. Where have they gone? I think we just lost two mats. <laughs> they under the motor. Ah, oh, they've gone into orbit. I think. Oh no, there's one. There's one. Well, it's nearly shut, isn't it? Well, okay, maybe that panel will go in here. Man, that pan is massive. Oh, it's chucking stuff everywhere, isn't it? Ugh. Right, that's in. That is in. Come on. Uh, we're done. We're done. Right. Fire up the old girl. This is obviously going to have to be a very careful drive. He's about everything's hanging out of it. Hold uh, on. Close enough. Days. Just have a quick look over there and see if that mat's not hanging about. Nope, not see it. Nope, that might as well go. Right, never mind. So let's just remind us of where I've got to go. Uh, junction, right, right. I get a free pair of ladders with our trailer as well. So it's actually down right here, isn't it? Now physics is still working, I think, so I'm going to take it nice and easy down here. And uh, I shall see you back at the, uh, the land. So here we are, back at the, uh, the plot. Happy as Larry. Fire. Getting a bit dark, so I don't know how much stuff we're going to get done today. Check that up there. We'll just pop this here. Happy days, right, not a bad wee haul for the first mission, sun's going down, we shall crank all of these open and start unloading stuff, do you know what I forgot to do, forgot to get fuel for the gear, that can happen in the next one, in a minute we'll just get everything set up and uh, unloaded, and then we know what's uh, What's going where? And what is what? So... I think... What goes down first? That's the extension, isn't it? So I think it's this bit that goes down first. Yeah, there you go. It's telling us where to put it. So, really hard seeing where you're going now. Go through here. 
boss. Here's another thing. I don't think I got a spade either. I'm a wally. Unless there's one in the uh, tent. I'll have to check that in a minute. Uh, so this is the one with the pumps. That's a scrunner bike. Lovely wee creek this, isn't it? Over here. So I like how this is basically... Here's a couple of quid. Here's a shovel. A wee pan. Rock on. Go for it. You know what I mean? I think that's pretty cool. Oh, there's a bucket already, look. So... This is the extension, so this goes in the end. One, two, three, four mats. Hopefully I've got enough, and none of them have uh, done a runner while I've been driving. There we go. Should have really parked a bit closer, shouldn't I? But no, man. I've got them all. Happy days. Right. I'll get them out and lie them here for now. I like how they stand up right like that. <laughs> Only thing I think they need in this game is. Oh shit. Is, um. Manipulation, so when you've got all of it, you can move it and spin it round and whatnot. I don't think they've got much of that in here. Why is stuff falling through my lorry? Just to be awkward, like it's all dropping through. Keep the jerry cans there. Because I'm going to need to fill them up. Like an idiot, I forgot. Can I get them from under there? Yep, I think that's all that went under, wasn't it? Happy days. Right, let's have a look in the tent. Oh, there must be for more equipment, look. Go for the bigger, uh, bigger machines. Oh, look, there's one in here. I'm an idiot. Ooh. So these are the other places. We'll rent Pine Valley, River Town, and the one we've got. That's only three. Hmm, huh, that's interesting. Almost not be finished yet. Transports, so that's obviously uh, getting your big equipment moved. Workers, you must be able to get workers, it's pretty cool. Machine storage. Machine store, all the heavy machine. Oh, equipment. So you must be able to do everything online then. Oh, that's pretty good. Well, we had a flipping pan in here, but never mind, I bought another one. Never mind, I bought another one. Coyotes, you can hear them. Whoa. So we've no floodlights or anything yet, but I think they might be coming. Checking out as it slipped. So what we'll do is we'll go up here and we'll sleep until uh, the next morning. And we'll get up early and uh, get it all set up. There we go, dawn is a breaking. So, what do we need to get down here? We need. I'll take that with me. We'll plonk it just here near the water. And we'll dump the pan near it as well. Go. We need on oh, the mat. So they're going from the top all the way down. 
obviously this is what your uh, mud is going to run over and it will filter out all the, all the gold and all the bits of dirt and shit as well like and put all your dirt back into the creek so as you can see there I must tell you the percentage of how full each mine is how much dirt you've got in and water supply which we haven't got hooked up yet but we will do shortly um, this can sit on this little bit here I suppose because that here yeah, that's a genuine. Keep that over there. Then the water pump. Go there for now. The mat can come with me in here. We'll stash this in the tent. Hopefully, you can store stuff in here. You poo do if you can't. There we go, we'll leave that in there. Um, we'll get buckets over. Because they are for cleaning out your mats, aren't they? Yeah. So you clean your mats out in the bucket, and then from the you dump your bucket onto that and that's when you start uh, going through it a little bit more happy days so right then we'll just Really far enough. Oh, you brat. There we go, that should be good. Then, one of these. Goes from the side of that to the back of that. Awesome. Oh, is that enough fuel? Oh. Okay, so I don't actually uh, need that yet. Don't think if I can put fuel in there. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Well, we'll put this back over here then. And we'll store this in the tent. I'll just dump it on there. Because I forgot power cables for it. Anyways, like an idiot. So basically all needs fuel, isn't it? There we go. Right. So back into town for fuel. Because me being a dipstick forgot it. And then we'll be set to do some mining. It only took us about half an hour to set up, but never mind. Eh? Right. So, firing up. Bit of power. Let's go fill up these jerry cans. I've only got two, but it should be enough, actually. I think the petrol station was further through town, weren't it? Oops. We'll see how the in uh, first person view is for driving. Bumpy, let's put it that way. Floor it! Oh, I still got a diff lock on. What was that one? 
Uh, hold on, I need to throw you. Hold up the world. Now, if you look in the back, it looks like when you've got at least the back closed, it uh, turns off the physics. So that's not too bad. That was a bit rough. This is a rough ass roll. Well, even the cop cars are rusted out. You'd have thought they'd have been clean and shiny, wouldn't you? Uh, what was Diff again? Oh, there's your time, there's your time. Uh, we'll make this one a, like a nearly an hour long or something like that. There's a special. And as we are only just starting, and then I may get a stream up at some point as well. Alright, so here's the fuel, and I like how they've uh, stopped you from going out there with a car crash. So we need Jerry comes out of the bike. I'm not sure how you fill these up here, like, but... Is it from here or is it from that? That's the question. I need fuel, dammit. Petrol station is a logical place to get your fuel from. Hmm. Oh, there it is. Fill her up. Two dollars and four. Is there no? No, there's no pump on that one. That one must be broke. That one's busted. That must be a wee fill level on the side. That's quite cool. There we go. Some crash that. Sheesh. Right, back we go to start mining. And you're all thinking about bloody time as well, aren't you? Banger right here. Oh, that was terrible turning by me. I'll tell me I'm stuck. Okay, be back in a minute when I've sorted this out. Okay, so after 15 minutes of faffing about, for those who don't notice, there's a reset button there. Click on the vehicle or you whatever, hit the reset and it resets it. it. Took me ages to do that. <laughs> not even gonna lie. That was something I did not see. So we're back on the road again, going back with the fuel. Thank God. That was a pain in the hoop. Oh, I like that. Yo. 
So apparently if you bounce up and down these roads too much, that's what knackers your tyres and stuff. Um, I don't know whether it seizes them up or not on these wheels like, but uh, we'll see. I'll try and take it easy and not smash the hell out of this pickup truck. I will hope in the future that they actually make other pickup trucks you can buy or you know, transport vehicles would be really cool or even just modify this one. That would be really nice. At the minute, I don't think there are any plans for that, but if it uh, takes off, it will. Which I think it would because it was actually advertised. That needs to bugger off. It was actually advertised during the uh, first episode, which we don't have in the UK at the minute yet. Um, I actually couldn't see it to watch in other means yet, so I don't know, it was supposed to have been. Friday it started, according to uh, the game. Anyway, so I don't know. But to get uh, to get advertising during the actual show, pretty damn impressive. Although I suppose Discovery have helped back this as well, so you would have thought that would have been uh, logical. The hit boxes on some of these things need seriously looking at. I'm about a foot away from that rock and it clipped it. They need to relook at that and just bring the hitboxes in to a lot closer to the actual friggin things they're representing. There's a few sloppy things on it, but all in all, pretty good so far. But you'll have to watch my review for that. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Back to our little abyss in the middle of nowhere. Take one for now and see what it takes. So, like how you've got your fuel gauge on the side of the canister, that's pretty cool. Bosh! Well, I hardly took any of that. I hardly took any. Uh, I'll leave that next to it, to be honest. Well, now he's tight. Sheesh. I'll leave that there. I hope to God there's a spade in this tent because I forgot again. Um, I'll leave that there. I don't want it too close to anything that can blow up. Please be a shovel in here. Please. Otherwise, he's back to town like a tit. I am a numpty. No shovels lying around outside? No, I'm not that lucky. Nope. I get all my mining equipment and forget the simplest of bloody things. What an idiot. Well, oh, what have we got here? Well, we've got a pick and an axe. Can't use any of them, right? But <laughs> Ah, bugger. Right, back in a minute. So, call me an idiot, but you already have a spade. Um, or a shovel, whatever you want to call it. It's uh, in your inventory, but it's not very intuitive to get to it. But I noticed this one was driving back. I wonder what that's for. I wonder if you can get rid of your soil and stuff and dump it in there. You know what you have left over. And get paid for it. That's going to be interesting to see. But anyways, let's get back to it. And uh actually get some flipping gold med, shall we? I'm gonna have a lot of editing to do on this one I tell you. That is a tight fit through there. And again them rocks there are really tight. So I thought there'd have been one in here, but there isn't. Okay, we're back. So, first thing is first. Settings, gimbal controls, previous tool, 
next to and it doesn't let you change them to uh, mouse wheels oh it does previous tool mouse wheel down there we go much more logical wow you need to seriously scroll that to actually get it to work that's ridiculous. I have to scroll 18 times for that to even move. That is terrible. That's something else I need to work on then. Picking up your controls. Because that is shocking. Uh, let's have a look. I'm trying to think of something easier. Uh, it was half an hour. Oops. Nice and simple. Doesn't make much sense how I've got it, but it'll do. Right, so. That is all set. That is all done. I'm not supposed to look that close, do I? We're going to dig over here first. Probably quicker doing it this way than actually putting it in the buckets. I've seen a few guys do it like this. So we're off. We're digging, guys. We are finally digging. Happy days, I'm stuck in a hole. Ten percent every one. Hundred percent. Right, I need to put them the other way around. It's really annoying me that. It is really annoying me. That one needs to be one. That one needs to be two. Right, done, yes. Happy days. Right. Let's fire this up. Where is the on button, ladies and gentlemen? There it is. Huh? Oh, wait a minute. I've got that on the wrong place. That's supposed to be in there. There we go. There we go. How much when you don't look at the ports? I must be able to run multiple ones in. Oh, he's chucking a lot of shit down there. Look. So basically, with that running, does that mean I can just keep digging and chucking it in? And I'll just constantly wash it through. Wow. Fairly equal all the way through so far. I'm not sure if this is brilliant land up to me on. I don't know what I'm going constantly. 
I like how it slowly stops the water as well, you know, it's not just, right, it's off, bang, there's no water there. That's quite cool. See what we'll do, we'll fill this up. Alright, and then we'll fill the buckets up as well. And then we can wash through the percentage that I put in, like this, and the three buckets full. I'll move some dirt, I think. So we'll take these up here as well. And then we can dump a load in them and all. Right, that's 100%, so let's fill these buckets up now. So I like that bucket full already. There's no way of telling you whether how much the bucket's old. It might just be one shovel full, which is a bit poopy for these, like. Right, that's that done. Let's go with the washing. Just washing through pretty relatively quickly. Really. They need to work out collisions and stuff on this because you do get stuck on literally nothing sometimes. It really slows things down. That's not going to work if that's only 10%. Dig this back bit really low now. I don't want to get it stuck, you see. I want to try and get it so it's a little smooth. just made it even worse. I can't remember how deep the dev said you could go, like 15 metres or something. Yeah. Starting to get really dark. We'll work up until 9 o'clock and then we'll call it quits. I'm going to wash out a mat in the morning. Oh, got a bit of gold this evening on there. Dump. Yeah, look, those bits running down. That's cool. Yeah, well, we'll knock it off now then. And we'll uh, 
sleep until dawn there and then we'll see what we've got in a couple of these mats. There we go, day three peeps, day three. Right, so, first things first. Need that filled up. Need... I'll get this top one up. Oh, what a wally I am. Got to put water in the bucket. Right. Oops. I missed. I'll give me a couple, just to see. Uh, one more for good luck. Nope, is that it? Clean water for. Oh, okay. Right, see that's back to zero again now. There's still quite a bit left in that bucket actually. Right, let's... In this one, is it? Oh, this one. Keep panning, keep panning. Two good bits, don't they? Oh, don't drop it. Collecting again. Oh, come on. Is a bit more precise. Shit. Point one ounce. Wow. Minute. <laughs> <laughs> It there. We've still stuff in this bucket, so. <clears throat> anyway, he's not making that noise. I don't think he's doing it right.
I'm going to get out of these ones, isn't it? Oh, that's awfully close. Close. I've been not clean this summer. Won't pick it up. He won't pick it up. I'm not sure I'm gonna have it. Not clean enough, maybe? I don't know. something clean up right that'll do for this episode guys what I'm gonna do is I am gonna go and um, get all this gold convert it to cash and then that way we can see how much gold I actually make uh, and it'll be easier figuring out you know what we're at gold wise I think that will be the uh, easiest idea Well, that wasn't bad. Uh, we got a little bit of gold out of there. We're still getting three minutes to go, so yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy it. Hope you come back for more. Uh, keep an eye out for the review, and I shall see you all soon. Later.